The New York State Health Foundation proudly supports Make the Road New York's Healthy Homes Initiative. The New York State Health Foundation concentrates its grant making in three core areas to make a difference. We work to expand health insurance coverage for all New Yorkers. We work to prevent and control the epidemic of diabetes across the state. And we also try to integrate the care for people who have needs for both substance abuse and mental health issues. But beyond those core areas, we also want to be a flexible and responsive organization. So we seek out and we support special projects that emerge from the field where the foundation can step in and make a difference. The Make the Road Asthma Project was really compelling to us for a variety of reasons. First, they were able to articulate a real need in one of the most underserved neighborhoods of New York City. Make the Road is a very respected organization with deep roots in their community and they've been working there for decades. And finally, Make the Road had a really innovative model to address the asthma problem in that community. Bushwick, Brooklyn is a neighborhood disproportionately affected by asthma. With 15.5% of the neighborhood's children aged 4 to 5 suffering from asthma, Bushwick's asthma hospitalization rate is one of the highest in New York City and is three times the national rate. A study was conducted to understand the roots of the asthma problem in Bushwick. The results showed that bad housing conditions, a lack of sufficient medical treatment, and a lack of education on how to prevent and manage asthma all contributed to Bushwick's high asthma rate. Tenemos que buscar la salud y más que todo no por mí, sino por mi hijo pequeño que él ha padecido mucho de asma y y me ha preocupado mucho por él. So that's two kids and my daughter and plus me with asthma. Everybody has asthma? Yeah. Lo más que yo limpio, porque yo limpio todo, lo más que yo limpio no importa, porque todavía se está rompiendo todo. Mira, tuve que buscar un gato, porque había un ratón así de grande que se iba a trepar en la cama. Yeah. Well, in Bushwick and, and some of the surrounding neighborhoods in North Brooklyn, asthma is uh, it's almost an epidemic. In fact, it's part of the asthma belt of uh, the South Bronx, East Harlem, and North Brooklyn. We see asthma prevalence rates that are double, triple, and quadruple um, many of the parts of the, of the country. Make the Road New York, with the support of the New York State Health Foundation, is working to address this pressing problem. Make the Road is the, the largest community-based organization in New York based in immigrant communities. And uh, we have over 3,600 members in Brooklyn, Queens, and Staten Island. So we're dedicated through community organizing, leadership development, legal services, adult education, and advocacy uh, to bring about real change. Make the Road attacks the asthma problem in Bushwick with a four-pronged approach. First, it addresses the poor housing conditions of many Bushwick residents. Through door-to-door -door home visits, community health workers help residents to identify asthma triggers in their homes, provide spacers for their inhalers and dust mite covers for their beds, and offer referrals to pest control services. These steps help to eliminate unhealthy conditions that can lead to asthma attacks. I wanted to move out of the place because I didn't thought that it was going to be fixed for anything. No way to get rid of those rats. They will go up and down the stairs like they pay rent. However, the work of Make the Road does not stop at home visits. Make the Road has a team of lawyers on staff to help tenants pressure negligent landlords to address dangerous housing conditions. And it's important for us to get the word out there that tenants can use housing court as a way to get repairs. And when they do, they're often able to get outcomes that maybe they didn't even know existed. People who come in are able to use the, the services that Make the Road offers or are, are able to, to go out and and uh, guide other people through these processes that are often really difficult to navigate. Though reducing asthma triggers in the home helps curb attacks, Make the Road recognizes that asthma must also be dealt with on a medical level through connecting community members to health insurance options and creating partnerships with local hospitals. Make the Road ensures that community members can access the regular health care that is integral to the prevention and treatment of asthma. When you have health insurance, you have the ability to have a primary care physician 
you have the ability to see a specialist and to get routine care, which for people who have chronic illnesses like asthma is such an important thing. Education and community outreach rounds out Make the Road's four-pronged solution to improving the lives of Bushwick residents with asthma. Make the Road uses innovative methods including weekly meetings, home visits, and street theater to teach Bushwick residents about asthma prevention, management, and treatment. Combining these four elements, Make the Road offers a comprehensive program to better the lives of Bushwick residents with asthma. Muchos consejos, como cuidarlo, lo que le tengo que dar, lo que no le tengo que, que aplicar, y ha sido excelente. As soon as I walked through that door, they gave me help. There was no problem. And then they told me, come to the meeting tonight. I did. As soon as I came to the meeting, the organizer came and helped me and made me an appointment with the lawyers, with one of the lawyers. And I became a member. Short after that, I became a staff. The Make the Road project was really successful, first because they were able to measure and document everything that they were doing at every step along the way of their project. They used the information that they were collecting in order to modify that model and make sure that it worked when they applied it in the real world. And Make the Road also set realistic goals for themselves and the project up front, so they were able not only to meet those goals but to exceed them. We have about 180 people in the program. Um, and with those people in the program that have been there for over a year, um, you know, we have 68% of them that have said that they've improved. Open up my eyes towards a lot of things that I didn't know. They helped me, and I'm trying to help the other people out there as, as they helped me too, because that's what we're here for.